Howdy, cranky friends. It's Sherry, and I'm back in the craft camper for another edition of Will It Crank with more of the ice yarn. Look at this one. It's so pretty. All right, so we're going to try out this one, the Cakes Jazz, and this is the rainbow color. Look at that loveliness. This has, this cake has 240 meters in it. It is a four weight yarn. It's very pretty. Can you see that? Can you see that? Yeah, we'll see how it goes. Cause again, I think it's generous, like the saver. We'll see, it's a little squishier though. So maybe it'll be all right. So stay tuned. Okay, so we're gonna try this out on the 48 again, starting with the central 48. I wasn't able to find the center pole and I don't want to make a mess of the cake. So I'm going to do the outside pole. So let's get it cast on and see how it goes. So you'll see here, I'm starting to have issues with the yarn wanting to bind up. So you'll see every so often, I'm actually pulling the whole tube down to be able to snap that stitch into place so I can keep on um, cranking. It's getting a little tight. Yeah, it's definitely not going so well. I think this is a bust. I think I'm not going to keep going on the machine. So I tried it out on the 48 and it did a bunch of tucks and a couple drops and the machine just really started struggling. Um, yeah, it's beautiful yarn, guys. So I'm going to frog this and we're going to try it on the Addy. So let's see how it goes. Okay, it's starting to crank a little hard. I'm at 46 um, rows right now. I'm gonna keep going kind of slow and we'll see how it does. I did end up having a couple knots back to back here. And what I do is I just tie those in like I would a color change. I cut the knots out and then I tie them in as a color change. They were pretty close together. It was a little annoying, but no big deal. So just something to consider. Okay, let's talk about the yarn a little bit. It's lovely yarn, but I would almost say it knits up like it's a five chunky, not a four weight yarn. Obviously I had no luck. I had about, I don't know how many rows I got to again um, on the 48, but I, I got a little ways into it and then it just struggled. The Addy, I almost had to stop. I actually stopped at 110 rows. So I ended up making like a kid's hat with it. Um, and I'll show you that here. See, it's very cute guys. It's a very hearty yarn. Um, let me show you the colors and this will be a nice reversible, um, little beanie for a child. And I'll probably try to use the rest of the yarn to make some kids hats. I don't, I almost was afraid to push it though. I couldn't go all the way to an adult hat because it was cranking pretty tough. I was having to go really slow with it. It's a lovely yarn. Just not, it's just a little too thick for the machines. I mean, you can do it, obviously. You just have to know that it's a slow go and you have to be, um, you have to be careful. No tucks or drops with the Addy, but it didn't want to crank. A there were some times it really didn't want to crank. Okay, let's go ahead and rate this out. So for, um, so for softness, it's, you know, it's not rough, but it's not super, super soft. It's softer than like Red Heart or something. I'm going to give it a three. Eh, no, I'm going to... Eh. I'll give it a three. I'll give it a three for softness. For color, I'm going to give it a four. It's really pretty. I love the colorway. Um, it's a little bit longer. It'd be really good for like blankets, but 
I don't think you can get through like the tubes to be able to do it. For knitting or crochet, gorgeous. I, I think it'd be gorgeous to use it for that. But for the machines, I wouldn't really, honestly, I wouldn't recommend it. Okay. So, um, so then for crankability for the Centro, it's, a, it's a zero. Um, and then for the Addy, I'm going to say it, it's a two, almost a one, but we'll give it two. Cause I was able to get through it without any tucks. Um, but yeah, I'll, um, no more than a two. Okay. And for overall loveliness, I'm going to, hmm, I'm going to give it a two. I'd give it a three, but since it was such a struggle to use, I'm going to give it a two. So it's not high on the yarn rating scale, but it's pretty nice. But there you go. It was the Cakes Jazz from Ice Yarns. You can see I have one more of those left. I'm going to try to, this is how much of that cake I have left. Um, so I'll try to make some more out of it. But it's not going to be something I'm going to start right away because it's just a little bit of a struggle. So just know if you want to try it, it can be a struggle. So hopefully this is helpful and thanks for watching.